Hi there folks, I'm meteorologist Alex Harrington with the News 3 Now First Warn Weather Team with another Beyond the Barometer Weather Explainer. And in this video, I'm going to dig deeper into our severe weather coverage from Friday evening where we were first to show you that wall cloud that was approaching the Platteville area with our Platteville Skycam. Let's dig into that and look at that video from Platteville. Look at that ominous looking sky. This is that wall cloud approaching the Platteville area on our Queen Bee Radio Skycam. Let me point out where that wall cloud is. It's this dark lower hanging base underneath this cumulonimbus nimbus cloud as part of the supercell thunderstorm or rotating thunderstorm. Also take note here folks, right hand side here. This is where that warm humid air is being drawn into the storm, at least partially. This is almost like a tail cloud where we've got that warm humid air being drawn in from the south and from the east and it's condensing, forming that cloud being drawn into the thunderstorm, into the updraft and it's rotating up and up and up into the sky. Again, this is a rotating supercell thunderstorm. Also of note are the downdrafts. I'll circle those here for you folks. This is rain-cooled air that's pulling down from the thunderstorm. And this is also where we very likely had the reports of two-inch diameter hail near the Platteville area. It's this rain-cooled air that we also watch. Again, I've seen many wall clouds and have covered many severe storms in Kansas even where we this was kind of an everyday experience in some instances where we would have these on sky cams and we would report folks what's going on here what can occur with the downdraft is that rain cooled air can get wrapped around and come into the foreground here it gets wrapped into the storm and what that can actually do is that cool and rain wrapped air comes in even dry air can help to pull the rotation that I was showing before down to the ground in the form of a funnel cloud or a tornado Luckily, that did not occur with this wall cloud near the Platteville area. No confirmed reports of tornadoes, at least nothing that I've seen at this point in time. Just wanted to take a moment here to call out what's going on with this wall cloud that we showed Friday evening during our severe weather coverage. If you have any questions or any weather or climate questions you'd like us to answer, we certainly would love to hear from you. You can always send them to firstwarn at wisctv.com.